Okay, some incredible fight training with Hayden Christensen and Ewan McGregor on the set of Revenge of the Sith. Just really looking at these green screen backgrounds here. Obviously, the actors were talking about this in volume in their interviews. And it's quite hard for them because, you know, they really have to use their imagination in terms of the backdrops that Luke has put in. You know, you're constantly cutting and hitting each other, you know, bare knuckles after the end of the reshoots. You know, and it's the same lights, it's the same green screens, and you're literally, you know, got to be 100% present at all times with your focus and your concentration with the fights. You know, this was intense work for you and Anne Hayden. Um, you know, they were looking up at each other as well as the green backdrops, imagining what's there, being told what's there. There's an enormous amount of blue screen and green screen, you know, in their fight and the film, and they have to really work hard to get used to that when you're doing the fighting sequences because you're really focused and concentrating on the fighting, you know, it's hard to imagine what the scene context is. Um, you know, Lucas sort of moving around, trying to change angles and really trying to capture everything he could for Revenge of the Sith. And you see that in the film because he squeezed every bit of saber juice out of it. These big sets, they took their time, they took their space. And then the practice stuff with Nick, you know, Gillard, who's an expert trainer, legend, who's done Indiana Jones and some of the biggest 80s fight scenes going. Here he is with Ewan and Hayden, really immersing himself in how you'd fight somebody, you know, and the, and the, and the fighting sequence and style that you'd take forward, you know, and to get through that with each other on these practice runs. It was intense for them. You can really see that in the footage. Um and again, I know this was a big shoot, this this sort of piece where it fell in the film. It doesn't look much. It's only a few seconds, but Lucas really took a long time over this. There was a big structure that was created. There was a lot of uh, after effects and CG work added afterwards, but you can see on the live capture a lot of physical work as well. Even the stunt doubles look incredible. Um, two, gr two guys that coordinate the whole thing and to accomplish the shoot and to get it spot on to how Lucas wanted it. And when it was all finished, you know, you can see here the doubles just coming in there. It looked fantastic. It's Nash Edgerton and Ben Cook. You know, obviously they didn't get the credit they deserved, but it's nice to see them there and behind the scenes. So some incredible footage.